Good morning, gamers. Welcome, everyone, to a very special Fear and Hunger stream. Today, we have one simple goal, and it is to whoop Grogoroth's stupid fucking ass. This has been coming for a while. It's Big Match John. Johnny, Johnny, no, body, Cena versus Grogoroth, and uh, it's all going to play out today. But before we get there... We've got a little housekeeping to cover here. That's right, two streams in the one week. Uh, an absolute miracle f that I have bestowed upon all you. Um, so, I was getting a little antsy about the run we were on. So, I held a secret stream on Wednesday to catch us back up to where we were with a full party... So that we don't have to worry about being too weak to beat Grogoroth and that we can just, just have fun. So yeah, um, the plan is to basically, as I, as I stated, whoop, absolutely just whoop Grogoroth today. And then next week, we start our final Fear and Hunger stream. At which point, our prey, it's not going to be Lagarde. It's not going to be Sylvian. It's not going to be Grogoroth. It's going to be the God of Fear and Hunger. That's next week. And after that, after and that, we are moving on to Fear and Hunger 2, a game I have never played. And the way that's going to work is that I'm going to be doing a bit a charity stream for Fear and Hunger 2. I'm going to be picking I'm, I'm going to be doing a charity for like and his yeah, name is John Cena. Like a mental health kind of suicide related charity cuz I think that shit's important. And we're going to do a big long stream some some Saturday. I'm still finalizing the dates. I'll get to that. Then after that, we're going to return to our regular Friday streams and I'm not going to continue the charity stream run. We're going to start from scratch on Fear and Hunger 2 using everything we've learned. Um, I'm very, very excited about it. It's going to be a ton of fun. I wonder if we'll get a... F mm. I don't know. I don't know if I can activate gamer mode. I think activating gamer mode two weeks in a row might be, over might be overkill. Anyone else feel that way? I, I feel like... I don't even know if I could, you know, I'm still, I'm like, I, it's activating gamer mode takes, it puts an incredible amount of, of what we, what we in the industry called gamer strain on your body. Um, and I don't know that I could, I could do it again. Um, see Nimona I have. Yes. Very good. Yeah. Uh, that's the thing about, um, that's the thing about gamer mode. Every time I activate it. I lose one year of my life. Um, I've activated it twice on stream and one time off stream. And the only time when I activated it off stream, that's when I figured out I could do it. And so I have lost, I've shaved three years off my lifespan. And as mo most of you know, um, I am, I am, I am 68. And so I think I have maybe another another 10 years and so if we're gonna if we're gonna keep using gamer mode i think we gotta we gotta kind of limit it good thing the final gamer can never die in video look, look they don't call me the final real lifer in in real life i am just as soft and weak and pathetic as all of you you know i am just one of you only in the games am i invincible um Final Fantasy 16 did you play? So, okay, yeah, I have been playing more Final Fantasy 16, and that game is so much more infinitely competent than Final Fantasy 15. Like, it feels like a finished game. The cutscenes are really well directed, there's like a clear flow and design to the combat and like intention in how you're meant to play it. And the voice acting is great. It feels really polished. So much effort has gone into the boss battles. It's cool. I just don't know if it's that interesting. Um, the more I play of the game, the more I feel like I'm playing like a pretty cool Xbox 360 game. Right now, the biggest thing I like about it um, are the, the Azura's Wrath-esque cutscenes. And um, Benedicta. Although you'll under like 
people who have played the game know will know that like you know with benedicta it's like she's cool but then stuff so yeah so that's kind of like okay and I think Clive's fun. I don't really give a shit about his story or anything. Like, I like him as a character. He's chill. But, like, I just... I don't really fucking care. And Baldur's Gate 3 is coming to PS5 in a couple of weeks. And I think 16 is just going to get knocked aside for me. And I think it's forever going to be this game where I'm like, yeah, it's pretty cool. And never beat it. Because I just don't know if I think it's that interesting. So I hear you're a Twitch streamer now, Mr. Wolf. I mean, apparently, I, I got to be doing something on here. Would you be streaming? Would will you be? Would you be streaming more after this fear and hunger run is done? Um. Yeah. Look, I think streaming is just something I do now. I like doing it. I have fun hanging out with you guys. I there's no fucking way I'd be still doing these streams if I didn't. Like, I I genuinely I think they're a really fun way to end the week. Um. Still kind of need to balance them against the like. I don't know four other things I do professionally, but they I, I've been having a great time with them. Played my house Doom mod. Okay, another little stream announcement here, folks. One of the things we are going to play that isn't Fear and Hunger at some point is my house is my um, is the my house Doom mod. Uh, I have heard enough people recommend that. I don't know anything about it. I haven't watched the video on it. I haven't read any articles about it. I just want to play it. Four of the things I do professionally, aka or porn. I don't do porn. I, if I did porn, I would not keep that a secret. I would be monetizing the fuck out of that. I, I would, I would be, I would be getting that bag as children often say. Not hmm, as people often scratch that. That that came out wrong. Um, but no, no, I do not do any that. Uh, I do not any do not say for content. Although the people who do, fair folk can play. Get that bag. Um, uh, the final porn star. No, no. <laughs> God, I, I should not have, I should not have entered this. OnlyFans win. No OnlyFans. Uh, no, I'm just. I, I don't think. I don't think you guys would. If you think you want that, I, I'm not sure that you do. Uh, um, that's not. That no. That's let let let's just let's just move past this. What else? Uh, um, saw. It's okay to talk about, like, A24 shit with the SAG after strike, isn't it? Because I, I, I saw a tweet going around there, and it was basically, like, because SAG after it, because A24 already meet all SAG after it's just, just, like, demands, it's cool to kind of, like, talk about them, right? I'd pay for your OnlyFans if it was you fully clothed and talking about Berserk. Well, now we have our angle. Now we have our angle. That's going to be my OnlyFans. I'm going to start it, and it's going to be me fully clothed under several jackets doing a chapter-by-chapter -chapter review of the brand new Berserk. Entry will be $50 per month. <laughs> Already subscribed. Oh, dear. Um... Still haven't read the new Berserk. Don't know if I ever will. I, 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 no, I will. I will. At some point, I will. It's just, it's weird. It's complicated. John, don't make promises you don't intend to keep. But, it, okay, if you, are, if you started, like, a safe for work only fans, <laughs> is it kind of, would it be, like, the opposite of YouTube or someone would come along and be like, you're, you're wearing too many jackets that that's not appropriate for this platform. Like, is that what would happen? I don't know. Um, so, do you know, for a while now, I have wanted to make a secret podcast. Basically, a podcast that I don't promote anywhere, and it might be just me, but I might occasionally have a guest, and you have to try really, really hard to find it. I think that would be fun. What's your favorite thing behind you? Uh, oh, why is... Probably this guy. Maybe him. Um, so just for people curious about what the bag was covering him, um, this was the bag that contains my my Gremlins figures. Um, and I know what you're thinking. Like, why do you need to own more than one Gremlins figure? Um, well, I, I don't. 
I own two Gremlins figures. See? See, there's the second one. Okay. But, uh... Now, you guys know I ain't no chump. Which is why I also earn a, uh, own, own, a, own a third Gremlins figure. Um... But I did. I still didn't want to look like uh, like just a loser, which is which is why I also own a fourth Gremlins figure. Um, and uh, at at some point I was like, well, four is too even. Like that looks too planned, and, and that's that's why I own a own a own a fifth Gremlins figure. So I guess what I'm saying is that if you're subscribed to my Patreon, you should really unsubscribe. Because, uh, this is a fucking joke. Like, what a ridiculous- what- that's- Clearly, I am misspending the resources that are being allocated to me. Uh, if you've subscribed this stream, you should do everything you can to get that money back, because clearly I am wasting it. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's- 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 that's that story. That was pretty good. I thought, pretty great piece of internet content there. Let me just clear all these- all the- the gremlin figures. I don't understand these people. I I really don't. Why would you subscribe? And his name is John Cena. And with that, my dear finalists, it is time. It is time. Um, gonna give my weekly warning here. Absolutely, 100%, non-zero chance of dicks on this stream. Fear and Hunger is, is, is a naughty game, and sometimes shit just slips through, okay? Okay. So, as you can see, we have John Cena, we have Moonless, we have Casca, and we have Nashra. We have a fully loaded party. We are descending into the depths and we are going to take out Grogoroth. I have never fought Grogoroth before. I know that this is the route you go to take him. I don't know anything about the fight. I am going in completely blind. Um, I would say for the first little bit, let's keep any like backseat gaming for the boss fight particularly quiet. Because I just want to figure it out by myself. I just want to figure out what the best approach is. So, we're all just going to enjoy the ride here. All limbs intact, we are good. In fact, Moonless... Moonless is a... I'm not joking. Moonless is a fucking wizard on this run. Uh, Lasat777, all limbs intact? What about Nostra? <laughs> I know, I know you're joking, but not like, that's great. That's, that's such a YouTube comment. It's, I love it. Okay. So, right away, why don't we take a little read... Okay, now let's take a look at our books. Hmm. We have Ancient Book. You feel a twist as you take the book from your satchel. You feel a great urge to open it, but at the same time, let's read the book. So, that monster right there, that's who... This monster... That's who we're going to kill. Oh, oh. Hurting. Ah, uh, hurting's not that good. Nah, I'm not sure I already know. So, okay, we're going to reload. Oh, sorry. Yeah, the A24 film I saw was Talk To Me. I enjoyed it. Good movie. Uh, it was weird. Like, very strange little horror movie, and I appreciated that about it. And uh, it cools from it's, it's It's cool. Like, if you're into horror, I would recommend it. It's like a really fun ghost possession movie. And it's cool that it's from a studio that, like, complies with all the sag after stuff. Um, I went to see it with Rebecca. She didn't like it as much, but I, I thought it was cool. Actually, you know what? We're gonna do this later. We're gonna do this a little later. Although I can't, I want to get I want to get blood gold. Um, I 
I've never gotten Blood Golem before and I want to use it. Can you learn Blood Golem from this? So good to see another Australian horror movie doing well. Yeah, and the, the, the cast is so good. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna leave that for the moment. Cause we we are probably going to die a little here. Okay. Okay, so something we learned last time was that if we equip the guard skin the moonless guards will not bother us. So we're all good, we can just avoid these guys. If we touch them, they're still gonna fight us, but we're okay. Okay, now my old nemesis. Nemes nemesis? The blades. Motherfucking blade master all up in here. Everyone bleeding? All my cloth fragments? Oh! Oh, that was bad. That's not a great start, chat. Um. How many torches do we have? Uh, oh, this is tricky. Ah! Okay, that could have gone better. What? Fuck this place. Oh. I don't like it, chat. Oh, God damn it. It's so cruel to have, like, those weird little, like, tile puzzles at this torturous stage in the game. Okay, so what's up here? You hear a crack on your feet. So slab is blocking our way. Okay, we need to go. I think we... God damn, this place, chat. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. The spikes can't kill you, so it's better. Okay, it's better. Yeah, good point there. The spikes can't actually kill you, so it's better to just heal up when you're past them. Dear God! Okay, no more, no more walking in the center of this place. We have been really lucky with, with the coin flips. Light's dying. this dude. Mm. 
Yes! The final gamer. Don't you people know that the final gamer always has a plan? Is there anything down here? Huh, is this just a dead end? Is this just a crowmaller room? Kinda looks like it. It's a trap pit. Okay, lesson learned. Whoa, shit. To go down one of them. Okay. Ah, crap. So we've just fallen down the trap pit. So he's gonna be down here again, right? Still stuck in the bear trap. Okay, that is that is a good bear trap to have. You are getting scared. No, I'm not. I'm fine. I'm fine. Um We are running a little low on the old uh, sanity restoring. Items. Ah. Uh, oh. This place sucks. Oh, it's so bad. So I'm guessing the pits all lead down to the crow mauler hole. Oh, I'm getting so lost. Oh, shit. Man, if you didn't have a guard skin in here, I would not want to try and beat this place. Shit! Oh, damn. Oh, that's not good. I don't think we can run for these guys either, can we? Uh, yeah, it is down to the right, but I just want to have a little scout around for any supplies. Um... Hmm. What if we just try and beat the shit out of them? Damn it. Oh, cask is down. That sucks. That sucks. Okay. Okay, look. This isn't going to be the run. We know that now. That's okay. We're learning. We're, we're collecting data. Whoa! Fuck. Why is there 3D? Hi John, I spent this week compiling a 398 page PDF and the historical record of how different cultures have approached vl blades slash avoidance. Can I send it to your personal email? No you cannot! I, I do not want to see that. What was that? What was that? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. I don't like any of this. Ah! What? 
What is that? What is that? Uh, 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 fuck it. Oh, what? Uh. Hmm. I. Hmm. I should have black orbed the head. I should have black orbed the head. See Moonless? See Moonless is an actual wizard now? How cool is that? Oh no! Oh, Moonless did two black orbs in a row. Okay, can we just can we just take this thing's torso out? What is this is like a lizard man fused with a yellow Oh Christ. Uh... Oh man, fuck that thing. Elixir of the mind. Okay, nice. Level nine. Uh um chat D -d don't know about all this now this doesn't this doesn't look good um you know what I kind of want to come back here with a full party intact I think I can see how we could do better I I don't think I have this is not the party I want to be in with I'm, 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 we're gonna come back, and we're gonna come back better and stronger. I know people be upset, but you, you got you got to know when to fold them. You got to know when to fold them. I'm pretty sure our song about being dumb and tough says something about that. Oh God, damn it! Whoa, Jesus Christ! Oh God, that 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 could have gone worse. Oh, okay. I still got it. I'm still the Blade Master. Nice. Okay, happy with how that went. Uh, we're gonna hug the walls because we don't want to fall down the crow hole. Oh, okay, I, I nearly forgot. I nearly forgot, chat. Okay, okay, okay. Feeling good. Feeling good about all this. Damn it. Ah, damn. So all those holes, they just bring you down to the crow hole, I'm guessing. And I know there's another one here. And that is where you come up from the crow hole. Yeah, it's not a big deal because we can just bear trap them. And we did kill him in a previous stream, but it's just there's no real advantage to us doing that. Oh my god, go, 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 go. I don't want to get squished. I don't want to get squished. Okay, 
scared. You're goddamn right. <laughs> oh, fucking Jesus. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. They have hurting? Okay, we just lost a shield. That's not great. That's not great. Oh. Uh, best burn in the chat definitely comes from Spaghetti Depresso. Depressi. Uh, Sion Arm. Uh, very good. Well appreciated. Great, great craft. Um. This. Okay, we're late enough into it that I think I can spare some body vials and we can just run up and try and whoop him. Hopefully before he gets us with that again. Uh, for people who might not be familiar, I'm not feeling feed I'm not healing Nashra because he just doesn't die. Huh! 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 <laughs> the yellow lizard mage neck wobbles back and forth. Okay, so. Can I just whoop this guy? Can I can I just black orb his head? Ah crap. That's Moonless's black orb. Oh my god, he lived! Oh no. Ah leave Moonless alone. Damn it. Good going, Moonless. Talk and ask for it not to hurt you. Seriously? Um, please don't. Hiss, it's the survival of the fittest. I understand your fear. You are but a feeble human, bravely against the crushing odds. Take this to even the odds you get through the body. Interesting. Let's <laughs> my nice. And you can devour these guys. You couldn't devour the other yellow mages. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, hmm. These guys are a problem. These I do not like these guys. Damn it. Oh, that's not good. I don't particularly want to waste, uh, um, I don't, I don't particularly want to waste, uh, um, a, t a turn on talking to them, because we already have, like, six, six, uh, elixirs of the body. Everyone's still alive. That's good.
Okay. We got everyone. Everyone's here. Heal and save. Okay. Um, save two. Did you save? No. And I think I'm just about ready to. Okay. Chat. Just want to be careful because I don't want to save over my last save. Okay. Okay. Chat. I'm going to go to the bathroom and I'll be back very soon. Okay. Okay. Chat. What does it mean to be a gamer? What does it mean to venture into a thousand worlds and emerge victorious from each? To some it's a hobby, to others merely a way to waste time. But to me, it's more than that, because I am the Alpha, I am the Omega, I am the final gamer! And this time, I have four valuable allies. We got John Cena, the motherfucking superstar cannibal who devours everything in his wake. We have the Moon Dog, Moonless, a wizard, a literal canine wizard. Most dogs can't even fucking read. This dog learned magic. She learned magic. We have Casca. And what more, what more could you possibly want from Casca, from the dream girl everyone desires, but the strongest, coolest person ever? And then finally, we have our insurance policy, we have the heater, we have the character that literally guarantees victory, Nashra. With those four allies at my back, I cannot fail. Grogoroth? You better fucking run, cause the final gamer approaches! Uh, now I have to start the game back up, cause I had to close it so I could, so I could, so I could play that music. Um, so yeah, just, I just, just take a second. Yeah. Oh, okay. Not quite sure how to navigate all this. Oh shit. We take a look into the black. Oh god. Oh, that's not good. Nashra. Yes! Kia, Kia! Grogoroth! You nasty, vile piss stain. This is the day. This is the day. What? Wait, wait, no, 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 chat. Ah, ah, um, not the time for subscriptions, chat. Okay, first of all, first of all. Uh, 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 forbidden. No one's allowed to clip that. No one's allowed to clip that. That's uh, that's not. That's I forbid it. I forbid it. If anyone clips it, you're banned from Twitch and YouTube. I have that power. I I can do that. Um. 
Uh, um, uh, not now, chat. But, okay, no, he's not, he's not gone, is he? Like, he's- his he'll... Name is John C. An ancient his primal name is John terror. This is so fun. His name is John C. Without knowing the timer, his demise has begun. Uh Okay, how many tar left eye right right arm I one, I two, I three, I four, Gorgor torso Um uh, okay, usually in fights like this I I wanna close his eyes. I feel like his eyes are related to the countdown. Oh my god, I I can't fucking believe this. That was my whole plan, get Nashra! Uh, no, I don't want advice. I don't want advice. Not yet. Oh god. Oh my god! Damage. He does so much damage. Okay, his eyes are closed, so that should stop the countdown. Uh, I guess we'll try work on his arm. Okay, John Cena has to use items. Let's see if the priest lantern works on him. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my god. And the countdown's still going. The countdown's still going. Um. Fire did not seem to work, and I I have two armless people. Um, can I red vile him? Uh, can I poison him? Uh, red vile does nothing. He. Oh, we can poison him. We can poison him. That's good. I never. Realized. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh sweet Christ. Uh. Ooh. I guess I'll heal. I guess I'll heal. This is so fucked up. It's it's just Casca, armless Casca, and armless John Cena fighting the god of destruction. Um mind, explosive vial. I'll toss an explosive vial at him. And the countdown's still going. Like, we're fucked. 
I will try a red vial again. No good. Okay, nothing. Um, I'll guard. I feel like all I can do is guard. The only slight... He's taking a lot of damage from poison. So the only slight hope we have... Is if the poison takes him. Oh my god. Zero. John Cena was defeated. Oh my god. Um, that is fucking insane. Wow. I can't believe what a monster he is. Like, he, like, that to me seems so much harder than Griffith. Shave your armpits. Fuck you. I think we gotta, we, go, we gotta poison him as soon as we get in there. That is my feeling. Um, will we do a fact-finding mission and see how long it takes to take out one of his arms? I feel like that would be useful. Uh, let's see what ancient magic we get. <gasps> oh shit. Oh shit. Should we put the Salmon Snake Soul on John, maybe? Mm, I don't know if I want to give up two turns. Okay, okay. Hang on now, hang on. No limb loss, though. But I guess my question is... How much good is John Cena going to be able to do? Like, I feel like we'd be better off putting the Salmon Snake Soul on Casca, maybe. Because the Blue Sin is really strong. Whereas we're going to be needing someone to doing items and healing. And I think John Cena should be doing that. Because... Casca can still move twice with fast attack, so I think the Salmon Snake Soul is best on her. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Um. Okay. Here we go. And give her Miasma, I guess. That would have been a good call, but Blue Sin is, is nearly as good as Miasma, as far as I know. Oh my fuck, I cannot believe that shit would not draw. beat this guy, I will genuinely do a little dance. Okay, so first things first. Um, let us get him good and poisoned. And let's get Casca doing her fast attack. Oh, I used to throw a knife instead of a dart. It's okay. okay. Oh, and I need to use Blood Golem. I'm all over the place, chat. I'm all over the place. Oh, oh my god. He's hitting so hard. He's hitting so hard. Oh my god. Can I create a second blood golem?
<laughs> Hollywood K, this is one evil foreigner John Cena cannot overcome. Amazing. Um, wow, Blood Golems have a lot of HP. Um, okay. Item. Throwing dart, not throwing knife. And then Casca. So I think... I think we need to close those eyes because they will just do a bunch of shit. So we need to use an explosive vial. No! Look, that blood golem just hit. Oh god. Oh. I don't think it's happening this time, chat. Oh. Now he's poisoned. Um, items. Let's toss the priest lantern at him. That blood golem. Yeah, I think we literally can't beat him right now. <sighs> oh, he killed us so hard, he broke the game. <laughs> just he ju he just he smashed us up and broke the gaming code. What if that was our ch shot chat? What if that was our shot? Necromancy. Yeah. Okay, we're we're gonna we're still gonna take a shot at him. Um, I think maybe. That off him. Give it to her. Our shield. Uh, this so... Okay, let's try this again. Cena poison. Okay, that's good. Got him! Got him! Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, God. Nice, Moonless! Oh, God. Hits John Cena hard. Um. Let's heal John Cena with loving whispers. And Dark, why don't you go after that eye? Nice. Shit, okay. John Cena. Let's try for Priest Lantern in the dark. I want to close that eye. I don't like those eyes. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, Moonless is down. Draw of God. Casca tanks it. Um, I now want to pile as much damage onto his torso as I possibly can. Whispers, casket. casket, attack the body. Nice. Oh shit. Oh 
Oh, he's such a monster. Um, okay, let's do an extra the body on John Cena. And let's squeeze another turn out of Casket. Loving Whispers Casca and we squeeze another turn. Nice. Nice! No way! Is it actually over? Is it actually over? I want to crush the old and gods. You crush. I am looking for the shell, a fraction of the traces that is left of Grogor Grogoroth. Yet even I could crush you in this very moment. Please don't, please don't. The older gods, they do not even exist in this world anymore. The older gods are too pure for this world. They are the true forms of the feelings and the ideas that linger in men. But humans, they are too tainted by their own minds and ambition to under- I, I, I don't believe we're done. I don't believe it. Think of the perfect shape of fear and destruction. Now take a look at the world you delve. Do you see that shape? The shape could never exist among men because the shape varies between every human. If you could truly see the shape everyone shares, it would shatter the individual mind and existence. Humans are weak. I can reveal the true form, glimpse of it. Your sanity declines at an alarming rate. You are gasping for breath desperately as the shock and horror shut down your bodily functions one by one. You feel terror run wild inside you. Despite being hardened by the horrors of dungeon, nothing you've witnessed so far read you for the primal females. You cannot operate in any way. Your body has to shut down as that is the only escape that can come with facing this older being. Your life runs past your eyes in a heartbeat. The biggest regret you have was to ever step foot in this dungeon. You now realize that the whole experience was predetermined since the very first second you laid eyes in this ancient fortress. Yes! Yes! You never escaped the dungeons of fear and hunger. No one ever heard about you again. Without a trace, you vanished from this world. It's almost as if you fell out of the history books altogether. Your screams of terror never reached anyone. Your long quest only gave you hints about the greater scheme of things. You learned a fraction of the secrets the ancient world holds. But even that is more than what is meant for human ears. Credits. Credits. Cre yes! Ending B. Is this a win? Can we, can we, yes, that's credits, that's credits. Oh, we did it finalists, we did it. We defeated that stupid awful god. There it was, the final dance, you all witnessed it. Saved only for the most dramatic of victories. And his Ooh, name is John hell yeah! Thank you for the anonymous gift subscription. And his name is John C. And his name is John C. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. What what a tremendous. Fear and hunger run. I, I really thought for a minute there we weren't going to be able to kill him. Too many a time. Not and yet. Not, not time for too many, uh, too many yet. There is one more boss we got to kill in Fear and, and Hunger. I don't know anything about this boss other than the fact it's called the God of Fear and, and Hunger. His name is John now, I will abide by this poll, and this is who we will get the final, or this is who we will defeat the final, the, the, the god of fear and hunger as. Uh, I think I spelt mercenary wrong. 
I expect everyone to be nice about it. The subload notification is a little too loud. I think that's just the right volume for such a notification. Let's play the Dungeon Night School. You planning on just looking up the character specific endings? No, I think over time I will come back and I will get every, I, I will do every character specific ending. But I think, I think I want to do the, the I, I want to kill the God of Fear and Hunger and then I want to move on to Termina proper. Of course, there is a dating sim in Fear and Hunger. There sure is. And it's surprisingly in depth. Uh, please max out Moonless for the plot final playthrough. Oh, dude, that would involve going to like 20 different locations and... No, I, I don't. I, I, unless, like, something really cool happens, does it? Um. Yeah, the true character endings have to be on the hardest difficulty, which is no saves or anything. Are you sure you can handle the God of Fear and Hunger? I think there's only one way to find out. But let me tell you, the final gamer has not been bested yet. You're telling me you can romance the Crow Mauler? I'm nearly certain you can. I think that's actually something you can do. Yep. Mercenary next same so next week usual time next week we're gonna start our final final run as mercenary okay guys listen love you all have a great weekend and I'll see you next week okay bye bye.